First tonight, Hannibal Public Schools held a work meeting as they near the finish line of a redistricting decision. KHQA's Ben Schmidt was at that meeting and has some of the key factors going into the discussion. Monday night was a break from the regular Hannibal Public Schools meetings as the board dug into the two remaining redistricting options. They can either keep all five elementary schools or shuffle things around by getting rid of Eugene Field. Everybody knows Eugene Field's a wonderful school. I mentioned that's where I started in the district and Eugene Field actually is a very well-built building. It's just 100 years old. Next year will be 100 years old. The decision comes with the district as of Monday projecting $1.3 to $1.4 million less revenue than the current expenditure budget although that projection will likely change. The biggest thing is probably then looking at the financial implications too. And you heard a lot of talk about that because obviously when you have less students, not only is that impacting your class sizes, but it also impacts your budget. And so uh, that's less revenue coming in that you have to you have to make up for. While finances were a big part of Monday's meeting and how the final redistricting option could help or hurt the budget, the impact for teachers if Eugene Field were to close also concerned board members. If we kick Eugene Field to the curb, I see a team of teachers that can't be duplicated. The thing I, I don't want to do is cut teachers. You know, that's, that's the biggest thing. You're going to have to find a way to come up with that money. The choice to keep or let go of one elementary school was not an easy one for the board. Just understanding that this is a very, very difficult decision and it's hard to, to think like a business person sometimes and then you, you don't want to forget the emotional part, but you've got to balance those. Those in the school district should know soon what the future of the elementary schools will look like as the board is expected to pick their option at the regular meeting on Tuesday, November 19th. Working for you, I'm Ben Schmidt.